Hi, I'm Peter Seraf. Join me when I talk to Craig Newland about my film producing career and Robin Wright's debut film, Land. And as bad as last year was, you personally did have something positive to show for it after backing The Farewell, which got nominated for a Golden Globe for Best Foreign Language Film, and A Beautiful Day in the Neighbourhood, which saw Tom Hanks nominated for a Golden Globe. Yeah, I mean, look, the, those two movies came out in 2019 and then, you know, hit the award circuit in 2020 and, and Aquafina, you know, being the first Asian American woman to win Best Actress at the, at the Golden Globes. And we managed to finish uh, Robin Wright's movie, and that's coming out at Sundance. I thought it was an extraordinary piece of writing and a great role for Robin. I've worked with actors who become directors a few times. I, I did a film called Everything is Illuminated, which was Leah Schreiber's directorial debut. I did a film called Jack Goes Boating, which was Philip Seymour Hoffman's directorial debut. So I had some experience with that. And I think actors who are who are passionate about what they do, they can make great directors. And in meeting with Robin and realizing that she had a really strong vision for the film, she directed, I think, 10 episodes of House of Cards. You know, it's different um, directing television, but she, she had a familiarity with being behind the camera and she had a familiarity with directing herself. And that was probably the biggest challenge. This movie is about a woman who leaves everything behind in Chicago and retreats to a cabin on the top of a mountain in Wyoming with no electricity, no phone, no running water, because she just cannot be around other people. She's getting to a point in her life where she can't function except in isolation. Mm-hmm.